Hi y'all, welcome back to the channel. It's been a little while and uh, I've been owing y'all some videos. Today, I wanna to talk to you about purchasing lithium iron phosphate cells from China. It remains the biggest challenge we have in, and, the, and the scariest thing, the, the thing that is most likely to keep people from jumping off and doing a DIY project building batteries for themselves so that they can get their energy independence. Um, I want to give you an update on that. Now, I know a lot of people have been interested in why I haven't been making videos and if you stick around to the end of the video I'm going to give you an update on the channel. When I'm, when I'm getting back into it, it will be real soon. It will, it will be now. And where I've been, what I've been doing. So let's jump right in here. Uh, I have made videos in the past where I have tested other people's batteries. I have been told one thing and sold another many times. I have had experiences where I got exactly what I asked for and overpaid. I have videos about this stuff. And many, many companies have asked me to test their batteries and test their products. It is so hard to find good companies, good products. And so I just don't fool with that much. And in the few times when I have, it's been, you know, not a very great experience. Um, it's not really my thing. It's how people make money on YouTube. I'm not really here to make money. But we do have to buy these cells. And the best way I know to get cells and not get lied to and get a good value is to deal with someone who's become my friend, Jenny Wu. Uh, I'm, I'm proud to say that she is my friend now. I've been working with her for, I guess, uh, going on two years. And not quite, but, but getting close to two years now I've been working with her. Um, let's see, I guess about 20 months. And um, I have had great experience with her. She has never lied to me. Um, I've gotten great product from her. I've bought 280 amp hour cells, 302 amp hour cells. Today, we have 304 amp hour cells that I got her to send me. And I'm going to test these uh, in the next few days. I wanted to open these boxes up for you and let you know uh, what they look like. These came from Houston. Now, they came with a UN box, which is... Uh, not what I'm used to seeing when I get these cells from other companies. They uh, typically give you an unmarked cardboard box and they don't tell anybody what's in it and it's cheaper to ship them that way. Oh, these, uh, these are coming with insulated tinned brass, uh, copper, sorry, copper bus bars. Brass bus bars, boy, that was a bad experience with one of those sellers who ripped me off. So, uh, and the serrated nuts. Now, they seem well packed. There's only two to a box. And that comes off easily. Okay, the battery comes out easily. It's not so tight that you have to fight it like I've had in the past. So let's see what the cells look like. Hmm. These look nice and flat. Oh yeah, these are perfectly flat. I've seen so many videos lately where people are buying these cells. You know, popular YouTubers are buying these cells and they're just not flat. And uh, 
these are, and I will be putting these into a, a fixture to try to keep them that way when I'm cycling them uh, as per the manufacturer, but also I think just I get asked a lot why I do that. and I, I don't do it, I don't try to compress these cells, but I don't want these cells to uh, impart pressure on these terminals when they start to expand and contract. And um, I've seen videos lately where all oh, the expansion can't be stopped. Well, it absolutely can be stopped. The expansion that, well, let's not get into that in this video. So um, I'm going to test these cells in the next uh, few days and I'll let you, I'll make a video and let you know. But here's the thing. When I purchased these cells, when I communicated with Jenny Wu about purchasing these cells, she told me that there are a lot of people who are imposturing her now. They're pretending to be her because Jenny has built a great reputation for being honest, telling the truth, working hard, and supplying good product. And so now you've got these unscrupulous individuals who are trying to piggyback on her reputation. Other companies put ads on Alibaba and AliExpress pretending to be Jenny Wu. There is only one Jenny Wu. And don't, don't purchase your sales on Alibaba and AliExpress. If you want to work with Jenny Wu, contact her directly. She has an e a Gmail uh, address, and you contact her with that Gmail address, and you know you're talking to Jenny Wu, and she'll take care of you. There's a lot of risk involved in buying these sales. When they buy these sales from the manufacturer and resell them to us, if something's wrong, you need somebody who's honest and is going to take care of you. And so you can contact Jenny Wu. Let her know that I sent you. If you do, she's going to write my name down on a list and uh, I will get a, a small commission for that. There's no affiliate link. It's all just, you know, her being honest and, and keeping track of it. And if you don't feel comfortable telling her how she found out about her, that's fine too. Uh, just contact her anyway, though, if you want to get uh, if you want to work with someone who won't lie to you, contact Jenny Wu. Her Gmail address is J-E-N-N-Y-W-U-896 at gmail.com. And that's how I contact her. Uh, and I'll let you know how these cells came out. All the ones I've tested from her in the past have tested well. I can't say that about everyone else's cells. Now, I promised you an update on the channel. I'll let you know about these in a week or so. So, here's what I've been doing. <laughs> the last videos I made were after the ice storm, and there were trees down everywhere. Central Texas got hammered with about three quarters of an inch of ice, and it broke most of our trees. We have, we're blessed with these beautiful live oak trees that keep their leaves through the winter and when they get coated with ice it breaks everything and too much weight breaks the limbs and dec decimates the trees. Well I have my ranch and I have my friend's ranch and I spent quite a bit of time with the tractor cleaning up all that mess and uh, because it just makes the property completely uh, trashed out. You can't, the cows can't get around and uh, the, it's, it covers up all the plant life. And so we cleaned all that up. And there's a lot of fences that need to be repaired and uh, cattle guards. And I uh, was having a difficult time finding a welder because welders are, uh, very busy right now. It's a skilled trade, and there aren't enough of them, at least in my area. Uh, 
I've worked with quite a few good welders and they're all so dang busy. They just tell you, well, you know, you'll have to call me in six months and maybe I can get to it then. I've just got all these jobs in front of you. And well, I went out and bought all the welding gear. I'm a dang good woodworker, but metal just wasn't my thing. But it is now. I've been fixing fences, repairing cattle guards, replacing pipes, building gates, redid my friend's garden, um, the enclosure around it, built new gates, raised the lid of it, uh, completely redid her garden, spent the day to day putting in drip irrigation for that whole garden so that she can just set a timer and adjust her watering uh, without having to do it all by hand, which is how we've all done it for years. So that's a uh, luxury. And, uh, you know, the garden shed, solar shed that I built on her place, I've got uh, videos that show how I built that. And it needed uh, fencing and gates to keep the dogs in and and stairs going down behind it. Well, the stairs were made out of wood and the railings and, and stair rails and gates uh, were made out of steel. Well, uh, maybe I'll show you that on a video. It came out great. Uh, I've gotten pretty decent at it. Uh, the backhoe on the tractor, uh, the frame for it was cracked from the stress of working hard for years and I use the plasma cutter and cut out gusset plates and weld it on and, and, and repaired that. And it just never ends now that I've got, now that I can weld, there are so many things uh, that need doing. Uh, I'll be building the, the frame for the extensions on the, on the, uh, on the solar array. And so, Anywho, I uh, have been quite busy doing that. Everything okay? So, um, my wife's taking the video. She said, I'm about to run out of battery, so I need to move this along. Please like this video. Please subscribe to the channel. I'm going to start making videos for you again, and we're going to finish up these these. Uh, systems that I've uh, made videos as I was building them. We're going to go ahead and, and set those, uh, put those into work and, and uh, ah, one other thing. Okay, two other things. I started riding horses and man has that been great. If you're interested in in that true horse whispering thing, understanding the horses and getting them to, I can lead the horses with an invisible lead rope. I've built relationships with these horses now where they trust me, I trust them. It's a magical thing. Um, I, I, I'm not going to tell you everything I've been doing. There's more, but I'm not going to tell you everything. This video is getting so long that the Phone battery's about to die. Y'all take care. Good to be back in front of you, and I can't wait to see your comments. Take care. Bye-bye.